December. It's time for the holidays and Christmas. Chances are you might be that you or somebody in your family might be getting a Nook tablet or a Kindle Fire, as you see here, for the holidays. And I want to take a look at three books that I recently found on the Kindle bookstore. The first one is How to Become the Most Viewed Video on YouTube by Daniel Craig. And the second one is How to Get Massive YouTube Views Fast by John Nyko. And the last one is YouTube Optimization. 10 Simple SEO Strategies to Help You with Your YouTube Video Optimization by Wayne Hatter. I'm going to talk about in this video why you should not buy any of these three books from the Kindle Bookstore. The first book I want to talk about is How to Become the Most Viewed Video on YouTube by Daniel Craig. This is not the same Daniel Craig who plays James Bond in the movies, by the way. This is the cover, and here's the copyright and about the author part. It says that this Daniel Craig is a video marketing professional. And then we have the contents. Let me read them for you. First one is write an interesting descriptive title for your video. Second one is add keywords in your tags. Third one is share your video on Facebook and Twitter. And then the fourth part is about get as many likes and comments as possible. Then it makes a comment that they took out one dra one section and redrafted it and made it number seven. And it says make your video to a, a video response to a popular related video and then get subscribers to your channel and so forth. There's about 10, 15 of them. Now remember those. Because in the next book, they're going to sound very familiar. Now I'm looking at the Nico book. The one from John Nico. And he starts out with a copyright and a disclaimer. And a disclosure there. And then he has a contents list too. There's the introduction. And then he lists like several different things here. One... These are each probably different chapter. Number one is write an interesting descriptive title for your video. Two, write a descriptive description. Three, add keywords in your tags. Four, share your video on Facebook and Twitter. Five, get as many likes and comments as possible. Six, make your video a video response to a popular related video. And so on. And as you, know, as you probably noticed there, a lot of them are like practically identical to the um, contents of the Daniel Craig book that I was just looking at. So it sounds like to me it's probably the same book. They just reworded it a little bit. Finally I want to look at the Wayne Hatter book about YouTube here. And you can see there's the cover for it. And let me turn it this way so it looks a little more there. Now it looks better. Again, you have about 10 sections here or so. He lists like syndication, annotations, caption, and stuff like that. You know. So again, it's, it's similar to the other books that we already that I already showed you just a few seconds ago. Now two of the books are available as part of the Kindle Lending Library, which is a thing where you can get book free each month from Prime. And if you don't have Prime, you have to pay $3.47 for the Craig book. I, I'm not sure how much the other two were selling for. But the Craig one is actually the oldest by like a month or a few days from the other two books. But I have no reason to believe that he was the one that wrote the original book. That I think he, he may have just um, like plagiarized somebody else too. I don't know. But anyways, selecting that one. Um, you can see it, it's only 27 pages according to what it says here in the bookstore application thing here. It was re released October 15, 2011. The other ones were re released 
really shortly after that, like maybe a, only a month or a month and a half later at the most. So I would not buy any of these three books. I think they're all plagiarizing somebody else's work. And I think Amazon should take these three books off their market or make them free and put some type of disclaimer saying that you should not buy these books because they're based on plagiarized work. And that's pretty much all I have to say about that, this issue.